Is this some weird monolith? Was it left here by aliens long ago? And what the heck is this thing that I'm looking at here in the woods of Ocala? Could it be ancient Mayan ruins? <laughs> well, not likely. But join me in this video and you'll find out. Now today's adventure, friends, starts here at the Santos Trailhead. And apparently we've got high bear activity in this area. It says do not feed or approach the bears. Don't worry, I will not be approaching the bears. <laughs> and we are on the Florida Trail. There's the place. All right, now we gotta cross the road. Get in there. Now, as you can see on the map, I'm heading to what they call the island. It's this little patch of woods between these two roads. Where we enter to get inside there, I'm not sure yet. Just walk around a little bit and figure this out. Ah, beauty berries. Now, if you're ever trapped in the woods, you're lost, and you don't have any food, you can eat these little guys. Okay, so let me tell you what I'm walking to and why they're here. Now, during the Great Depression in the 1930s, President Franklin D. Roosevelt started his New Deal program, and he approved funds for the Cross Florida Barge Canal. It was gonna be a canal that connects the Atlantic Ocean to the Gulf of Mexico, and the construction began in 1935 of these bridge piers. But in 1936, construction was seized because a Michigan senator challenged the project saying they never received authorization from Congress. Now the canal project started up a few more times, but in the end it was canned due to environmental reasons. And now friends, these supports remain. These have been here for a long time and they're built tough. And they're not going anywhere. Nothing's gonna knock these down. <laughs> they're here to stay. Well friends, I hope you enjoyed this interesting look into Florida's history and I hope you join me again sometime in another adventure soon. Take care and always remember to be excellent to each other. Bye-bye.